broken our losing streak. We've barely been scraping a living the past couple of years, and the Anisadora is starting to look like the wrecks we salvage. Can't say the crew's been faring any better. Then, we found that flight recorder. It belongs to a ship, the Nostromo, Wayland yutani property. That means there'll be a reward. But then, Marlowe had an even better idea. Extrapolate the path of the flight recorder to try to find the wreck of the Nostromo. We got lucky, found a distress signal, and now we're following it. This is it. I can feel it in my bones. He always said he'd do right by me. We're outside Sevastopol. Milo and Foster woke up first. She looked terrible. Meeks and me are about to take a shuttle to the station. But well, this has got to break quarantine procedures, right? It's Milo's ship. She's Milo's wife. And things got heated, and Meek's got a bloody nose. So, I don't know. Maybe the doctors will give her the all clear and things can get to normal. But if they sniff it out when we get on board, I don't want any part of it. Milo doesn't pay nearly enough for that kind of noise. In case you're hearing me, I've got the Anisadora's basic power systems back online. Doors should be open. Hopefully some light. Still no sign of Marlo. Hey, Ripley. Welcome to the Anisadora. Marlo? Where are you, Marlo? Thanks for switching the power back on. You saved me a job. I only needed it offline temporarily. I had some things to fix. What are you doing? 
Sidora. This is Marshal Waits of Sevastopol. Officially, I should deny your request to dock. Sevastopol is currently being decommissioned, and I can't compromise security for unscheduled vessels. However, in the light of the property you found, I will allow a small number of your crew to dock via a short-range shuttle. I must remind you that Sevastopol is entitled to a cut of any reward for return of said property once it's on station. Let me know your decision. Waits up. I tried to stay in Boston. Brought him to Sebastopol. Recall the rules, getting her ashore. That was stupid at me. Stupid. You don't beat this thing, Ripley. You can't. All you can do is refuse to engage. You gotta wipe out every trace, destroy any clue, stop its infection from spreading. Make sure there's no chance of the human race ever making contact with it again. Because the moment it makes contact, it's won. The company is never going to know what happened here. Nobody is. I won't allow it. Added report, personal message. This is for my daughter. Hi, Amanda. I'm recording this for you, my sweetheart. And I hope you get to hear it one day. You see, I, um, I got into trouble. Um, my ship, there was an accident, sweetheart. And um, we found an alien creature. It was very dangerous. And the only way we could stop it was to destroy the ship. Uh, I'm okay. I'm stuck on this lifeboat, long way out. But we had to destroy the ship. We had to destroy the Nostromo. We just couldn't risk bringing that thing home with us. I needed to protect you. Don't worry. Don't worry about me. I'm sure I'll see you very soon. I love you, sweetheart. Monsters 
not. She was my wife. I loved her. And I killed her. I think that was too late. He set it going. He set it going. Taylor, I'll stop the overload. You have to help me. Go to that console. Warning. Fusion reactor overload in progress. Open the fusion system so I can work on them. What? I need power sent to the auxiliary generator. Look for the letters A-U-X. Overload! The ship's gonna tear itself apart! 